An auction this weekend is giving you a rare opportunity to own original works of art made famous by a Fort Wayne native. People from around the country have already expressed interest in those paintings that depict Indiana landscapes. News Channel 15's Gina Glaros joins us in Studio 15 with your chance to make one of them yours. Those involved in the auction say this weekend's event is once in a lifetime. In fact, I was told that the longtime auctioneer calls this auction unprecedented. For half a century, Homer Davison's paintings hung on the walls of the Peabody Retirement Community in North Manchester. But they were always present, but no one really knew of their value, which is the way we wanted to keep it. Davison's wife, Bess, brought her personal collection to the Peabody, where she moved shortly after Homer's death in 1957. Her husband's artistic roots were really Somerset, Indiana, which is about 20, 25 miles south of here. And... Um, uh, this was her love. These paintings, all 21 of them, depict life in Indiana. Over the last 20 years, the value of the paintings skyrocketed. All but one of them will have a starting bid of $2,400. They were kept in common spaces for people to touch, for people to perhaps take and put in their car if they wanted to. And we are, uh, we decided we would be better stewards. With the money, 20 new endowment funds will be established. Once this auction went public, the Peabody decided to move the paintings to one locked room, letting fans see the artwork by appointment only. This weekend, they'll be coming out of this room and maybe into your home. In its place, printed images will return to the walls and tell the story for the next 50 years. Now, the paintings are among nearly 1,500 other pieces of art up for grabs. You can take a look at the paintings this Friday evening, and then the auction is Saturday starting at 9 a.m. inside the chapel of the Peabody Retirement Community. And for more information, just head to the story on Wayne.com. In Studio 15, Gina Glaros, News Channel 15.